Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel, Somebody Cosmic. And in this video, we'll be testing out Spider Man 2099 uniform in World Boss Legend in Mephisto Stage 24. So, let's get a details page real quick. I have max attack speed, max critical damage, max ignore defense, and max kill cooldown with 52% critical rate. I don't think we should worry about critical rate because I think he gives himself a critical rate buff from his fifth skill, which should max it out. Um, <clears throat> for the gears, they're all level 25, no Urus on them, no others, blessings, nothing. Um, all of his skills are at level 6. He is a rank 4 for his type enhancement. Sage 6, Hawk's Eye, no artifacts. I have a CTP of energy on him, and the uniform is at normal. Uh, for the cards, real quick, I have the all basic attacks 81%, the physical attack is only at 3% because Spider-Man 2099 deals physical damage based on physical attack. And I have 11% pierce damage. For the X of Swords, I have a 24% uh, all basic attack increase and 9% physical attack increase and about a thousand uh, instinct attack increase uh, that's pretty much it for him and we are going to jump in World Boss Legend stage 24 of Mephisto and see how well Spider-Man 2099 performs at that level with this build that I have on him Till I collapse, I'll be moving too fast. Got my foot up on the gas, full throttle till I crash. I'm back with a vengeance. You gon' see me end this. I will be ascending. I don't ever slack. I got my eyes on a prize. What I see for my life, I don't float. No, I fly. Do or die. Cause you gotta do or die. There ain't no compromise. Get ready for a fight. Do you wanna see what you made of? What if there was no one to save us? Would you leave it all on the pavement? Would you dive the ground with some straight blood? I just wanna find out my limits. I'ma put everything in it. I'm in this life to win it. And this is just the beginning.
I see her rolling up, Uber black Cadillac, high heel boots, and a sexy body full of tats. Baby's bad, oh baby's hella bad. After her, there ain't no coming back. Wanna take a run at that? I think she's feeling me. Turn it up a few degrees. My imagination of her body gets the best of me. Oh gosh, she's such a tease. Big lips. So, as you guys can see, he was able to absolutely crush stage 24 off Mephisto. Uh, although, keep in mind that I did waste a little bit of time trying to maneuver behind uh, Mephisto's attacks because they were stunning me almost every time. So, uh, there was, there was a, lo a lot of time that I got wasted on that uh, stage. But nevertheless, his damage is absolutely insane. Miguel O'Hara absolutely crushes him, his damage is absolutely insane, his survivability is good, yeah, I, I thought I thought like 15%, uh, what is it, 15% heal recovery of his max HP was not good enough, but I think it is good enough, he's already tanky dude, I think he already has like damage reduction on his tier 2 passive, or his uniform effect I believe, I think it is on his uniform effect that damage reduction, uh, yeah, he has 20% damage decrease, he has 20% chain hit damage increase, and he has 20% damage increase to boss types. This dude is stacked for damage, 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 damage everywhere. High damage, good survivability, and very rarely where he takes any sort of damage. Like you guys could see. On Mephisto, when I was trapped with those tornadoes from Mephisto, with those fiery tornadoes, the damage was not in triple digits, it was only in two digits, uh, which is pretty good, which is pretty, pretty good. He's really fantastic. This uniform is top to bottom rework. His tier 3 hits uh, like a truck. It already has 200% damage increase, and that does stack with the basic damage increase 200% from the CTP of energy. So, yeah, uh, Miguel O'Hara is absolutely insane, he completely obliterates Mephisto, the, like Mephisto is now banned, he's completely banned, okay, he's, he no longer exists, this dude, he's a menace, I'll just say that, so yeah, Miguel O'Hara, Spider-Man 2099, absolutely fantastic, great performance, great survivability, easy to play as well, by the way, uh, the rotation is pretty simple, 3 cancel, 4 cancel, 5 proc, although there is some slight, slight delay on the 4th skill that you need to do just for a half a second I believe, uh, and then cancel it to the 5th skill so that the animation from the 4th skill can actually appear, because the 4th skill also deals damage, so you can actually cancel the 4th skill half a second after you activate that, and go to the fifth skill. So, yeah, um, the fourth skill that has this holographic holograms versions of Miguel O'Hara that release explosions when they fall. So, yeah, there's that. Uh, pretty busted. Pretty busted. I'm really, really happy with this uniform. Miguel O'Hara has been one of my favorite versions of Spider-Man after Peter Parker, so I'm really, really happy with this uniform, really happy with this performance. Great design, by the way, this, this uniform looks absolutely fantastic. The fangs, you guys can see the fangs on his fingers. Yeah, the claws on his fingers, they have like those fangs and shit. So, yeah, I'm uh, re really happy with this. I'm really happy with this performance, I'm really happy with this uniform complete rework top to bottom and high damage high survivability easy to play character definitely worth tier 3 if you wish to use one for world boss legend so yeah i'm really happy with this so we're just gonna wrap it up right here guys thank you guys so much for watching if you guys enjoyed this video hit the like button subscribe and share so help the channel grow and hit the notification ring bell so you miss out on any of the upcoming videos on this channel we're gonna more future fight content and join my discord server the link is in the description box below and i'll see you guys on the next video take care peace